everyone. Welcome back to the Terrifier Podcast. My name is Samia. And I'm Darren. We are a Pinoy physical therapist duo living somewhat unconventional but intentional lives. We aim to achieve financial independence in a few years, but we try to make our journey fun so we don't go crazy. In this podcast, we want to learn how Filipinos all over the world in different industries and walk of life earn, spend, save, and invest money to achieve financial independence. Today, we are going to chat with our dear friend, Mr. Mark Robin Chu, on his journey towards financial independence. Hello, Mark. Good afternoon. How are you doing? Hello, happy couple. <laughs> <laughs> Enjoying this great weekend. Oh, How are you? Doing good. How are you? Where are you now? I'm here in the chat. It's an old church. Really cool. so I'm really ready. <laughs> I have my cup of coffee here. Habang nagmimisa ba? Nagmimisa. That's a good way to repurpose a church. <laughs> yeah, very good way. <laughs> so you can, you might hear some music because there's a live band. Oh, mm-hmm. that's okay. Narinig ka namin. So before we uh, start off, can you introduce yourself the way you want others to introduce you or know you? So, my name is Mark. Um, I'm a physical therapist. Um, and I am currently enlisted in the United States Army as uh, oh no. uh, a little about A little bit about myself. Um, I, I knew Camille from college. He's a good friend. And Daryl, his husband, is awesome. And um, yeah, that's an adventure. Saan ka pala ngayon, Ju? Uh, nandito ako sa Maryland din. Uh, I'm visiting a friend actually. Mm. Tapos, uh, you said you were a physical therapist din. Pero are you practicing ngayon as a uh, physical therapist? Or? Actually, I am. So, um, because yung hours ko sa military, uh, ng 3 o'clock lang kami. So, I found a part-time job that's doing flexible in hours. Oh. Um, so I'm, I'm, I'm still practicing as a physical therapist. I try to do four hours a day or at night with this um, nursing facility. So I'm starting Monday. So I'm excited. Yeah. Yeah. Just recently started. Tipag naman. May pinag-iimpo na. Kailangan, kailangan. Kailangan, kailangan. Kailangan mag-ipon. So... Um, with this uh, podcast, we are um, actually um, trying to uh, find out about the journey of our kababayans towards financial independence. What is financial independence for you and how did you uh, encounter it? So, uh, financial independence for me, I didn't really encounter it. Um, it always has been my goal. Um, but, you know, get, getting here in the U.S. is one of the steps to get into that. And to be honest, um, my goal to financial independence is really, really just live life. Like I said, I, I value adventure. Mm. Financial independence for me will just give me that chance to live that life. Okay. So you want to uh, live a life of adventure. That's why. Yes. Yeah, that's what financial independence will give you. So, saan ka na open sa financial independence? Sabi mo, even before, even before going here sa US, aware ka na sa, sa, sa path na to. May nag-open ba? para may nabasa ka ba? Or may na-encounter ka ba na tao? Kaya mo nalaman ko? Or just innate na gusto, pinapursu mo talaga yung path na yun? You go more of like innate. More, so, like, more of innate. So innate. Like, oh, that's good. <laughs> well, um, ever since I was a kid, I'm a free soul. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So, I'm a free soul. So, when I was graduating from college, and after that, earning some money. That's it. You can know freedom and to do things. But there's a deep sense that I know I'll be tied to just working for the rest of my life. Um, 
So, wala naman ako nabasa. So, wala akong nakita, wala lang na ito. It's innate in me that I want to be great. And that I want. And then eventually, so, 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 growing up as an adult, kasi alam natin, di ba, we have like this happy with it. Yeah. Have your mind, you can put in everything. And um, then at the past of me, oh yeah, I might need to like, earn more money to gain that independence to do things that I want. So, pumasok sa isip ko na, oh, there, there might be other ways to get to that point early. So, yun na rin yung one of the reasons I joined the military is to see that avenue. Kasi alam ko marami mag-open up ng doors from like the problem benefits and also the experience that I'm going to do. Mm-hmm. 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 So, so, so how is the life in the military for you too? I'll be honest, it's very hard. Ah. <laughs> yes, because um, considering that I have experience uh, and also I had a very comfortable life very very good salary but i i saw myself not doing like, the same things every day mm-hmm. like, for example the usual retirement age 65 mm-hmm. i cannot i cannot see myself like doing the same things every day and then, ko lang yung military as a way to get there earlier because if i do 20 years 25 years I'll be getting up tension. No. Oh. Okay. So I'll be able to retire the current picture. Mm-hmm. But that's very early. Mm-hmm. 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 But if you, uh, how, how can you compare the your life right now, the military, compared to civilian life more? Oh, well, definitely. Definitely, there's less freedom here in the military. Mm-hmm. Less Maybe freedom. Like, in, in some ways, less freedom to do things that I used to do. Okay. But I'm more free to think about things. Because really. mm-hmm. uh, I'm in the Navy, I, I really love being at sea. Because there's no distractions. There's no cell service. Mm-hmm. Uh, when you go out, all you see is the sea. It kind of puts you in a perspective that I am small. My problems are small. Then I can internalize it. Then I see that oh yeah, may, may I have to go. So I can do it. And to to relate it to this podcast, we have this. Yeah, financial financial independence. Because mm-hmm. alam alam mo ang dream ko talaga is to live in a farm. Okay. Ah, that's fine. Up, yeah, wake up every day, you know, tend to the animals, the horses, and kahit malit lang yung nang wala ako check it, like my tension. If I do get it, get it. And I'm, I'm just gonna survive by that way. Simpleng buhay lang, no? Mm-hmm. Ano yung mga, mga things na namimiss mo? Kasi sabi mo, um, you have less freedom in the military. What what kind of things that you used to do na, na hindi mo nagagawa ngayon na namimiss mo? Uh, let's see, let's see. Good question. Being able to socialize with the people with the with the same like not experience but same let's see mindset. Okay. Yeah. Because it's a military case you won't be able to choose the people who you know interact with every day. <laughs> but you know, as a civilian you can in some ways, not negatively, you know, choose mm-hmm. your friends. Yeah. Uh, isa ko pang namimiss is yung ano, after work, after work na talaga siya. Sa military kasi yung 24-7. Okay. And, and there's always a sense na when they call you, you have to go back. Mm-hmm. Oh, definitely, one thing that really makes having my own friends. <laughs> okay. Oh, Your privacy. So I remember when you were here, you, you were telling me na before meron kang ano yung apartment mo talagang very may that may nakalagay dyan. Parang alam mo yung yung mga nakalagay dun sa places mo. Gusto mo very, may character ganyan. 
<laughs> That's a very deep person, Petro, eh. Tapos, nang, sa kwento mo nung nag-military ka, ito lang yung pama, ito lang dapat yung gamit, kailangan mo ibenta yung mga ano. Can you, can you share to us more about that? Well, that experience was actually a really good experience for me. Because nakita ko yung ano yung mga inesensyon sa life ko and what is essential. Right. Mm-hmm. In some ways, parang nakakatulong din siya sa akin towards my journey to financial independence. Kasi mm-hmm. alam ko na, oh, I don't need a fancy bed. So I don't need like five beds in my house. Right. Mm-hmm. Only this one that's to be comfortable. Mm-hmm. And um, yeah, nakita ko talaga yung value na So, when I was like pulling out my stuff from my apartment, I saw that I have a lot of you know, records. So, I like old things, but I have a lot of records. I have a lot of yeah, I have a lot of film cameras. I have a lot of type fighters. And I saw that oh my God, this stuff, I'm not saying that. I'm not saying that. It's an experience for them. So in some ways, hindi siya nakatulong sa akin sa goal ko na to get you know, mm-hmm. retire early and be financially independent. So, your experience na yun, has, it was stressful. <laughs> kasi, oh, no, siyempre, kasi I have to pick like, oh yeah, ito lang yung makilangan ko. Pero, ang laking value siya. Sabi ko nga yung skill ko na nakakuha ko from that experience, dadanin ko na siya on the way to the future. Mm-hmm. And eventually, I'll start my own family. So right now, uh, basically, you it's like you were stripped down of, of everything and just the essential was left with your life. Is that, is that it? Yeah. Okay. So I thought, it's, um, ay nga, may linya nga sa movies sa Pilipinas. Sabi ni, it's like, jalika pa ng libat ang sa'yo. And, uh, kaya palang i-compress ang buhay sa dalawang bag. Ah, okay. So, nagawa, nagawa mo yun? Oh. Yeah, that's how I am right now. So, yun, lahat ng gamit ko na sa coach ko, which is a small hatchback. It's, it's a Volkswagen Golf. Okay. Nagkasa lahat ng coffee. <laughs> so, where do you keep your things now? Yung mga so, yung dala dyan sa military. Uh, yung gamit ko, so I... I I, I'm renting a very small um, storage just for my extra uniform and um, actually car parts because I work okay. on my own car. Uh, para makatipid din ako. Oo nga, nabanggit mo ako rin. Pero kasi may hindi ka rin talaga mag-repair, repair ng mga ano. Mag-invent, mag-repair. <laughs> Yeah, saka in some ways, talagang sabi ko, innate, innate nature talaga sa akin na magsipin. Manakita kong kaya ko gawin. Gagawin ko lang na. Parang DIY, no? DIY. Yeah, well. yeah. <laughs> bakit, bakit of all jobs na pwede mong ipalit as a physical therapist, why did you choose... Uh, Um, get, getting inside, I mean, joining the military, do you think na, ah, I, I'll join the military kasi I know that I'll, I'll be able to reach financial independence sooner, ganun ba yung maisip mo, or is it because of other things? Um, it's, malaking bagay yung sinabi is to get the financial independence early. Mm-hmm. Pero, minista ko yan. Minista ko yung personality ko yan. Ano ba yung mga aspirations ko? What I usually do? And what do I value? So, yung na ko yung personality ko, I'm very adventurous. Um, hindi ko naman yung negative yung PT, pero nakita ko yung sarili ko na I'm not, I'm not doing the things that excite me. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so, yun nga. So, so yun, military, you get me places that not most people will experience. Like, yeah, it's like being out at sea. It's like, oh my gosh, it's unreal. Tapos, yun, natanong ko nga, sarili ko na, if I do this, I'll retire like in 20 years. Saka lang. Yun nga, yung mga bagay na bagay na sa buhay ko. Because for me, money doesn't mean that, iba yung meaning ko sa money. Money is just a way for me to be comfortable. It's not, hindi ako mag-iipo ng pera dahil pera siya. 
So, what benefits from the military that helped your journey easier? Mga makukuha ka ba na mas mapapadali yung journey natin towards five? Oh, yes. Uh, number one is the pension. It should be 20, 25 years. So, ang benefit um, once you get to the 25th year mark, okay. 100% of the salary that you have, ayun yung magiging pension sector. So, the highest, the highest salary you get on the 25th year mark, 100% of that salary will be double check. 25th? On your uh on uh, your twenty fifth month, you will get kung ano yung pinaka twenty fifth year. Twenty fifth year. The pinaka matas mo sweldo, one hundred percent na na makukuha mo in pension. Correct. Wow. Pero ano yung pension? Is it is that every year na matatanggap mo? Is it monthly? Parang sweldo ba yan? Allowance? Hmm? Ano sweldo siya? Parang sweldo ba? Sorry na po. So, so correct me if I'm wrong. So, kunwari, in your twenty fifth year, let's say kumita ka, may kita ka ng one hundred thousand. Ang pension mo is 100,000 din? Yeah. Pag nag-graduate na? Wow! Just adjust, adjustment siya with inflation din. Wow, and it's a, it's a wow. job with migration. <laughs> I don't know, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what the percentage for inflation is. It's the pension. Yeah. I, I think so, it should okay. be substantial. Or, oh, it should okay. be enough, I think. Really? So, ang ibang tao ginagawa, ang tawag namin is double dipping. So, we do that. So, we must have a 18 years old. So, just uh-huh. add 20 years to that, 38 years old. So, they're still really young. Uh-huh. So, what they do, they get another federal job. For example, they join the FBI, actually, post office, or any any federal job. So, there is no pension check. It's based upon pension check alone huh? from that federal job. So, you double get it. So, pinapayag, pinapayagan nyo ng federal government yung double dipping? Okay. Is that, okay. Huh? It's very common. Okay. So, post office. makukuha mo yung uh, 100% ng sweldo mo from both? Uh, depends on how many how many years. Eh. Oh, I okay. see. But for ka magkaroon ng pension check, I think 20 years. I think this is like 75% or something. Okay. Because every year to matas to get one year. Yeah. But that's I think that's substantial already because oh, use <laughs> military pa lang. Okay na. Eh. Okay na. Yeah. Okay. Tapos once you get to uh, age 65, you get that social security check. Tapos dadig bigyan pa na social, social security. Pa so e- e- everything that you know, your income really comes from the government all throughout. <laughs> yeah. And your uh, so when you finish 20 years. You become a lifetime member of Tricare. Of what? Tricare. Tricare. Ah, Tricare B. Yeah. Now you're not some patients. So you don't, you don't pay out. You one hundred percent if you're a member of Tricare. Okay. Wow. After twenty years, yeah. After twenty years, you become a lifetime. Okay. Uh, they're becoming um. Indisha 401k, we call it PSP. PSP is a thrift, thrift savings plan. So, Parsha 401k, pero ano siya? It's two, two separate things. It's the traditional and the Roth IRA. So, yung nag- naguhulog ka doon. Parang 401k, naguhulog ka every paycheck. Like, you set the percentage by 5%, 5%, 10%, 10%. And then your retirement fund then mm-hmm. So what will happen if you retire for example twenty five years? You have that pension check every month, and you have that big savings plan that the balance is around four hundred one k. Hmm. Pero in order for you to get all this, kailangan you really have to serve for twenty five years, no? Yeah, twenty to twenty five years. Very um, right PSP. In PSP. PSP with you? Or? Okay. Kahit umalis ka uh, early? So, pag umalis ka, 
ang TSP kasi for all for federal employees for government employees. Okay. So, for example, you get a civilian job. Hindi ka pwede mag-tulog. Pero sa'yo pa rin yung pera. Okay, okay. Pwede mo siya. Pwede mo siya yung withdraw 30 years from now, 15 years from now. Pero pag nakakuha ka ng federal job, for example, uh, sa government, uh, post office, kapag federal job, pwede ka ulit na tulog. Ah, uh, parang rollover lang, parang ganun. And yung PSP, it, um, you can invest sa stocks doon o parang savings yeah. lang? Yeah. Ah, I see. It's a 401k. It's like a okay. 401k. Uh, merong traditional in Roth. Okay. Pili ka na ng portfolio. So, okay. pari, ako, uh, lifestyle fund ako. So, pag lifestyle fund. Lifestyle fund. Ang lifestyle fund, it depends on your age. So, pag, pag medyo younger ka, pag medyo younger ka, medyo risky yung, yung mga stocks. So, ah, parang, ano, risk more than me. So, uh, so yeah. para siyang uh, pag pinili mo yung lifestyle fund, ikukompute niya yung age mo, ipapaktor yep. niya dun sa sa portfolio. Uh, Ako for real, kasi lalabas na yung kanong mga stocks yung bibili doon portfolio. Okay. I think para siyang yeah. equivalent ng target date fund sa mga uh, IRA yeah. at sa mga, uh, uh, That's sa like mga 401k. Yeah. Uh, so, uh, so, ang magiging ano niyan, pag nag-retire ka, meron ka ng yung mga benefits tapos pa nag-double dip ka dalawang benefits meron kang health healthcare benefits tapos hindi lang naman yun yung pera mo nag, nag, oh, nahulog oh. ka sa TSP di meron pang perang lumalago na right. tapos, at, 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 uh, at the side tapos meron pa pang oh. nabanggit sa amin nun eh na parang yung libre rin yung aral mo yung asawa mo rin ba parang libre rin and yung kids no? can, can you tell us more about those uh, benefits? So on that benefit, um, so once you get to boot camp, you get the GI Bill mm-hmm. and the post 9-11 uh, bill. So ang MGI Bill, magbabayad ka, lang ng 100, um, magbabayad ka lang ng $100 every month for one year to get that benefit, which I did sign up. Mm-hmm. Tapos yung dalawang yun, that's free college, so two, two degrees. Tapos pwede mo siyang i-transfer. Yeah, you get like two college degrees. Okay. Uh, tapos, you can transfer that after 15 years of service. I wish I transfer sa dependents mo. So you get, you can give like free college to your wife, your kids, as long as saan sila, dependents mo. Um, now, isang benefit pa pala is yung tuition assistance. So while active ka pa, while active ka pa, you can uh, get courses na babayaran ng military for free. But you just want to get like, let's see, a diving license, scuba diving license, mm-hmm. or a certification like me, a physical therapist, you can get a certification to be an orthopedic clinical specialist. Mahal yung test na, but like, it doesn't have that. So I can apply for tuition assistance. Okay, good. Do you have to serve for a certain number of months before you go in your tuition oh, yes. assistance? Oh. Tuition assistance is three years. And also MGID and the, um, the post-9-11. I have to serve 36 months. I'm sorry, hindi ko, hindi ko narinig yung isa. MGI bill, saka ano yung isa? Post-9-11. 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 So, with regards to yung degree... This is any school and any course? They will pay 100% or how, how does that go? So, on that part, may mga schools kasi na mas mahal, di ba? Mm-hmm. So, may percentage usually na, ano, na babayaran ng GI Bill. Okay. Mas maghahanap ka ng, merong for military lang to, is yung yellow ribbon. Okay. Um, so, babayaran nila yung matipin mo. So, you get, you'd still get to school for free. Um, one example one example is nag, pa nag-med school ka um, okay. cover, cover lang is just 3 years of med school kasi mahal lang med school mm-hmm. so yun may, may limit yun siya kala ko pwedeng lawyer oh mas gusto ko pong maging ano doktor <laughs> <Okay. laughs> I think I'm a triple degree <laughs> oh Kaya, actually lang, no? ay nga isa rin kaya sumali ako ng Navy is that door will open for me I can go back and just get another psychology degree, a business degree. So, you know, just to further my 
what you call this income income potential. Mm. Oh. So nasa radar mo rin pala yun na uh, magkukuha ka ng uh, another degree para uh, mag-open up sa <laughs> yung ibang careers. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Wow, that's yeah. good. Yeah. Yeah. Ang gusto ko pa doon is hindi mo na kailangan isipin yung possible na mag-iipon ka pa for college ng kids mo, di ba? Kasi if you're planning to serve sa military ng 20 to 25 years para makuha mo yung pension, sabi mo lang naman, you have to stay for 15 years, di ba? Para yung mga dependents mo is makakapag-college or yung future wife mo, <laughs> yung future wife mo is yes, pwede rin mo pag-aral ng, ng, uh, ng government or from your from your MGI bill ba? Sama ba? Yeah, ako? from the best. Yes, from the best. Okay. Tapos, ano po yung mga ibang yung benefits? Ang dami-dami naman. Bakit ba hindi kami nag-military? <laughs> well, I'll, I'll be honest. The military is not for everyone. It's definitely That's a lifestyle. Okay. Uh, you're going to sacrifice a lot. You'll be away from your friends, your family, your mm-hmm. love. But, ayun yung mga ibang benefits pa. Going back to housing, loans. Ah, pinigil pa that for us too. Mm-hmm. So, the mga housing loan is no down payment, no interest. No down payment? Wow! Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. So, what mm-hmm. happens then is, parang pag kumuha ka ng loan, di ba, there's a traditional loan, there's a rural, I forgot what it's called, but rural, if it's a rural area, mm-hmm. you get like a lower interest rate. Yeah, I think that's the USBA loan. Yes, USBA loan. Um... Ang VA, parang ganun din siya, pero you can live on this basis na hindi siya covered sa USDA. So technically, you can buy a house anyway. So, no down payment. I think the rate of payment is like 3%. 3%? Not bad. Yeah. No, 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 no down payment. Parang napag-usapan din natin yun before, eh. parang we believe, mag-ano ka, huwaka ng house, no? No down payment, tapos i-housak mo pa, no? <laughs> Yeah. Ano kung ilang anong kumita? Ayun nga, isang avenue din yun. If I have the ability to do it, I can just buy, you know, along the way, let's say, ano ko eh, once you get married, or once you get dependent, you get a housing allowance, which depends on what area you're in. May housing allowance pa? Yes, yeah, so for example, that's why I don't know that. Oh. May housing allowance pa, may housing allowance pa na tax bill. Okay. Uh, so, for example, San Diego, they get uh, a check every month for two thousand five hundred dollars. So you can look for uh, a place na to, let's say, kung paro kung nawa yung house mo is ano lang one eight lang, you can get the seven hundred. Mm-hmm. Ah. Okay. So, Tapos, ano to depende sa location mo. So kung mas mahal, mas mahal yung mas malaking ibibigay. O kasi naka-adjust siya for, naka-adjust siya for uh, living expenses. Depende sa cost of living sa area kung nasaan pa. Which is depende kung saan ka naka-assign. Yes. Okay. Well, tawag namin doon is uh, BAH. 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 Allowance for Housing. Okay. BAH. 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 So, yung kaya rin. Kung, uh, just tell me if I'm wrong, parang marami akong naririnig ng mga allowance na binibigay sa inyo yes. sa military. So, mostly yung pay mo talagang sa ilang lahat? An- anong, ano, ano pang, so wala akong ginagawa. So, kasi kung may food allowance, tapos may housing allowance. May food allowance din? Meron. Uh, ano naman yun? BAS. So, Basic Allowance for Sustenance. Kailangan mo talagang isend sa amin yung mga letters. <laughs> <laughs> so naka ano yan naka dependent kung ilan yung dependents mo dependent ka sa area siya tapos Pero, meron pang ano kaya rin na-deploy ka uh-huh. meron siyang ano yung separation separation from family okay so once you get separated from your family may dagdag siya pala uh, house ano pa hazardous pay just I know you know nabili tayo sa hazardous pay so once you get like this Ang maganda pa, kuyari, na-deploy ka sa lugar na tax-free. So, you get your, your, your check tax-free. Zero ta. Tax-free talaga. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. So, wala, wala. so basically, uh, yung paycheck mo is wala ka na talagang gagasis nito. Uh, kung meron ka lang ang gusto. 
Wala siya for basic needs. Wait, pero yung sa ano, housing, yung, wait lang, yung housing allowance, saka yung sa food allowance, iba kanina na pinag-uusapan na, o dapat 15 years ka muna bago, bago mo makukuha kong tuition, dapat 3 years ka muna, dapat gantong years ka muna. How about yun sa mga housing allowance, saka sa mga food allowance, do you get it right away or after serving ilang years ka muna? Get it right away. Right away? Oh. <laughs> That's sign up for the... <laughs> <laughs> no, really, when you tawag namin page 2, the page 2 is the list of your dependents. Once you update your page 2 that you're married, or you have a kid, the next month, you And you can use that basic allowance for housing to buy a house, actually, to pay for mortgage. Uh, you, you can choose to rent. If you want. But most of the people here, um, I'll be honest now, May mga tao dito four years in, they have three houses. Like, yes, because it, it's zero down. Tapos tutulong, yung, yung mortgage is uh, paid pa through the BAH. Oh my. <laughs> Tapos meron pa silang, ano, food allowance. Wala na talaga, Cho. <laughs> Nagaluhan mo kami nun. Kaya pa ba? 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 You have, to, you have to weigh in. Not uh, rainbows and butterflies all the way. Uh-oh. Maraming benefits, pero asabi mo nga, hindi, hindi para sa lahat. Mm-hmm. Kasi iniwan mo yung buong life mo before eh. Yeah. Just, lahat. I'm glad I did. Because I won't be able to meet the people that I met. Yeah. Yeah. It's really, yeah, it's, it's really an act of service to be in the military. Kaya, oh, um, uh, dapat lang nga maganda na, na yung mga benefits na nare-receive na, na, na mga nag-serve. Pero pang isa is uh, Service Members Civil Relief Act, SERA. Okay, what does that give? So, for example, you had credit cards before you joined the military. Mm-hmm. So, makatap lahat ng interest rates mo to 6% pati yung loans mo. For example, you have a car loan, you have a personal loan, student loan, credit card. Lahat yung makakap ng 6% interest rate. Wow. So, baka kat siya ng 2-6% or by 6%? 2 6%. 2 6%, okay. Kwari, so, 25%. Kahit, magiging 6%. So, kahit na yung loan na yun, ginawa mo pa siya previously. Kanyari, dati pa ako bumili ng kotse. Ayun, ayun, ayun talaga yung, ayun, paano doon talaga siya? Kasi kung nag-open ka ng loan na uh, active duty ka, mm-hmm. di na siya mag-apply pa po. Paka na lang siya pag yung before yung show. Oh, I see. So, hindi why? Yeah. No, bash. Mm-hmm. Bash. Ang maganda pa doon, may, may, ano yan eh, may technique daw. Oh, anong technique? Oh, anong technique? Gusto namin. So, for example, you joined like late, later in the year. Um, let me see. Tapos nagbayad ka ng interest rate and ng interest for your credit card or your Okay. Pag nag-apply ka na for SERA, tapos sakita nila yung months na active duty ka na nagbabayad ka pala ng mataas interest rate. Ipaprorate ko or i-reverse na dito on that day to that time. So lahat ng binayaran mong interest rate ng itong, ito nag-apply ka ng NCRA, diba? Mm-hmm. Ito yung active duty kasi ito yung lend. Mm-hmm. Lahat ng binayaran mo sa time na ito, i-reverse na Huh? Ibibigay sa'yo kasi mataas yung interest rate nun. Oh. O oh, oh, kumpitin yeah. nila yung difference. Oh, wow. Kapag pwede na yung difference. Oh my God. You get like money. Like, for example, you're paying for <laughs> you pay your car as like a 12% of the street. Uh-huh. And hindi mo, nala- hindi mo alam yung SCRA. For example, okay. nag-join ka ng January. Nalaman mo siya December na. Di ba, laki yung 12 months. Mm. So yung 12, 12 months, nagbabayad ka ng interest. Hindi ko compete ng bank. 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 On that date ng bank. Okay. So, paano mo makukuha yung benefit na yun? Kakausapin ko yung bank ko, hey, I'm in the military. Okay. Di ko alam nila yun. Kung kala mo kausapin yung boss mo o HR ba ng military. I'm just gonna show um, what I did is yung parang ano namin, face tab. Tapang kami face tab. Uh-huh. Nakasulat kasi doon yung ano yung date na nag-start ka. Alam na ng mga bangko yun. Mm-hmm. Face tab tapos. I think ID ko ata. Mm-hmm. Military ID. So lahat, lahat lang na ako, lahat ng credit, 
Lahat ng credit cards mo is 6%. So, lahat ng loans ko is 6%. Which is wala naman akong loans. Wow. I, I... <laughs> Grabe na overwhelm ako sa dami ng benefits. <laughs> parang, ah, pwede pa ba ako sumali? Oh, pero sabi mo nga, mahirap. No. Pero, <laughs> parang, worth naman yung hirap. Pero, sabi mo nga, not everybody is cut out to do it. So, yeah. So, so, yeah. Ano, hindi ako ikap yun. Baka iwan si Kapi. Hindi, sa samba din siya. So, marunan ako. Kasi ako, hindi wala yung pata. Pero may separation, no? May separation pa yung separation fee. Pag iwala niyo kami, may bakit pa rin kapareho, ha? Well, one option you can do is reserves. Ano niya? Reserves. Reserves. So, reserves has technically the same benefits as an active duty. Pero yung computation ng retirement, Uh, different siya. Dapat year per day. Parang ba? Kasi pag reserves ka every weekend ka lang. Okay. Mm-hmm. So doon lang nabibay lang yung years. Mm-hmm. Yung years of service. Ah, Medyo matagal yan. Medyo matagal na yun. <laughs> matagal yun. Matagal yun. Matagal yun. Matagal yun. Pero, pero ganun din siya. Meron kang uh, medical, I think meron kang medical like, think, benefits. Pero same say. din ba ang way na mag, mag-enter sa reserves in training o The same. You same. get to boot camp. Oh. Yeah. Yung sa ano, kasi kanina di ba na-discuss natin yung sa healthcare, after ilang years mo mag-serve, you can get the tri-care, tapos isa, parang ano ka na, okay ka na ng healthcare mo, but may Medicare pa, di ba? May Medicare din ba kayo? Or, mm-hmm. so, I'm not sure. Pag ganun. Not sure. Pero, kunwari, pagka, pagka-join mo sa military, yung healthcare mo rin ba? Uh, 100% covered mo? Yeah. yeah. Hmm. Kaya pag-active ka. Any kind of injury you get to go to the hospital, show your ID, or social security get a phone. Pero paano yung ano mo, future wife mo? Future wife mo, oh, yeah, tsaka yung mga... Uh, yeah, you go over there, free then. Pero Both kailangan ka sa, sa hospital lang nila o pwedeng sa ibang hospital? Uh, depende kung in-network yung hospital. Mm-hmm. So Tapos technically, yung parang, yung parang, parang... Yeah, parang ano din siya. Parang insurance lang talaga siya. Right mm-hmm. here. Pero doon, wala kayong um, hino, walang kinakalta sa sweldo nyo for medical insurance. Unlike, kasi diba sa, sa, sa atin, may kinakalta sa oh, dental, wow. vision, sa inyo wala. Oh, wow. Wow. So, ang, ang, ang nababahos lang talaga sa sweldo nyo sa, sa military is basically tax. Tapos kung sa tax-free area ka pa, walang tax. Oh, nga. Oh, okay. So, sa, oh, oh. Kita lang. Not benefits. Yeah. Wow. Tapos, so, technically, wala ka naman kailangan gasto sa talaga eh. Yung gagasto si mo lang is, kare, kakain ka sa lapas, or you buy clothes. Yeah. Pero, so, wala ka na rin naman lalagyan, di ba? <laughs> wala ka lalagyan, wala ka lalagyan. <laughs> Pero sa, sa dami ng benefits na to, ang naganda ng benefits na sinasabi mo sa amin, Meron bang mga challenges na na-experience o naririnig ka sa, about sa people in the military o umalis sa military? Na may financial difficulty sila o nahirapan sila mag-manage ng finances nila? Well, ganun naman sa lahat, you know? um, People make good choices. People make bad choices. Mm-hmm. Um, ang maganda sa military, we have a lot of education with financial. Uh-huh. financial. Wow, may financial education classes pa kayo, ha? Yes. Um, before I went to my ship, pero kami na uh, life skills. Um, life skills. Life skills. Okay. Which is uh, two weeks. It's two weeks of um, like you know, financial courses, um, courses on the benefits that we get, um, how to budget. Wow. Wow. Uh, 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 yeah, and um, there's always a financial advisor. In every what we call it command. Okay. So sa atin, meron kami I think there's like seven financial counselors um, that you can get free financial advice. That's one-on-one? One. Yeah. One. Wow. And Mahal you get ba yun sa labas? <laughs> Oo nga. Tapos yeah. free, ah. Yeah. <laughs> free. And uh, meron din is uh, You get like legal advice. For example, you're gonna do like a training or you can buy a house. Um, a lot of educational uh, benefits. Okay, ang maganda kasi hindi lang binibigyan kanila ng 
Maraming pera, benefits. benefits. Pero tinuturoan ka nila how to handle, ng how to handle the money. money. Oh, oh. Kasi nga, may mga iba na, kasi baka, baka recently lang nila yung ginawa, yung mga, yes. mga members before is ay, ay, ano, kung, yun, sumasali sila na bata pa sila and then they have all this money Tapos, they don't know what to oh, do with it. Alam mo naman, sometimes we have some patients na oh, nag-serve sila sa military before so ang expectations natin is their life is gonna be a lot better mm-hmm. pero iba nga. Pero sabi mo nga naman different choices different people, different choices. Mm-hmm. Pero maganda lang kasi na may nag-effort ba yung military na oh turuan namin kayo about sa pera para pag alis nyo nasa ibang nasa outside of the military na kayo you know how to handle your finances yes, very it's, uh, yeah very common kasi with me yun na sabi nyo na people have hindi sila makalakuan ng success from the military kasi nga nasabi nga yung military people would join us with young people Okay. Oh, yeah. 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 Party! Yeah. With all that money, I'll get, a, I'll get a new car every year and uh, buy, yeah. buy tons of houses, no doubt. Okay. I see that the behavior is changing. It's changing. Kaya okay, inaalagaan nila like, through like, meditation. As long as you find the seat net, you will listen to it. So yun, yun yung naging talking. Make bad choices, you'll end up in bad choices. Make good choices, you'll end up in bad choices. You said before na bago ka mag-join sa military, you are, you make a list on on your goals, on your uh, strengths, on your, maybe on your weaknesses. Do you always practice that in, if, if you're entering a new career, new job, or any phase of your life? Of course. Yeah. To be honest, mm-hmm. without the states, without even thinking about all the things that you know, I'm going to go friends, I'm going to go to my family, I'm ay na feel ko sa trip ng mga oras natin para ng mga times na nabawasan ka na hindi ba hindi natin alam hindi natin so ngayon matutunan ko from that experience is to make this kung ito ang mga to make a life decision I still do that um I believe you see me like you know I'm always journey um it's good practice kasi sometimes when you see something Um, on paper, it becomes like more real, just be, like, yes, compared no. to just having it in your thoughts. Mm-hmm. So, that's what I'm really going to do. Retire early. Okay. The world is too amazing. Like it's Are you planning to um, go back, work as a physical therapist again, a full time? After ilang years sa military, kasi I know there's an opportunity for you to work as a PT there, di ba? Parang pag-usapan natin, magiging lieutenant ka agad. So, um, that's actually what I'm doing right now. So, ang um, pinaka-goal ko talaga kayo sa mga mga military student officer. Kasi I have all the degrees. Kasi I have all the degrees. So, nakuha ko na yung citizenship ko with the CSEDU. Yeah! <laughs> which is like a big roadblock to be an officer kasi to be an officer you have to be a citizen so nakuha ko na siya so now I'm, I'm kind of starting the process to get to that point kasi sign the experience um, I do love treating patients kasi I love helping people uh, like in my deep deep soul parang sabi ko Oh, my mission is to do is to you know, give lights to six people. So like, sabi pa rin mo, I like this. So, in a way, I'm fixing people. Mm-hmm. My work. Uh, Doon na din, ano, papasok din yung mga doon. Uh, mas mabag, mapabibilis yung journey to take the national independence kasi yung sweldo ko yung know, yung two times three like what I do now. Um, And also, gold ko rin kasi talaga, I want to lead people. Once I become an officer, I'll be leading people. Because technically, I'll be a manager. 
and positioning officer. Uh, is it really for, uh, I want to I want to like direct people to like in a way I think some people can use it. Oh no man. Pero mag- ang maganda lang talaga is magiging ano ka na, matitriple na yung sweldo mo, hindi yung pakilang galawin. <laughs> Ayun na ka eh. Na ka. <laughs> Para bang naging tax-free? Parang gano'n, alam mo yun. Is that going to be another, a, a few more years of training to, to be an officer? Or? Uh, no, that is. Uh, so if I become a sister of therapist, then we can discuss that. Um, I think it's like one month, two months to train. Akala, akala ko naman years of training tapos saka ko pa lang magkakaroon ng I don't think so kasi doctorate. may doctorate ka na eh bakit pa ma- ano pa ano pa, ano pa ano pa bang training na gusto na ah ano kasi ang so sa military there's na parang mga mga group of uh, commands so hiwalay ang medical from like um, war fighters mm-hmm. meaning it's yung mga pagpunta sa mga deployed areas mm-hmm. um, ang medical ayun parang staff na talaga Repeated as a staff, but you have that um, position mm-hmm. as the officer. Ang maganda pala pag hindi ka sa bali tayo, um, as my freedom to practice your profession. So, you can order x-rays, MRI, mm-hmm. you, you can prescribe painkillers. Wow, direct access siya sa military? Ba? Yeah, direct access. Um, you don't need a referral from the doctor. In a way, parang in a way, parang I'm gonna experience something different from what I used to be. That is very different. Oh, it's a practice that we uh, usually following doctors' orders and all that. Yeah. Parang kapag wasapa natin kanina, yung work sa military is 24/7. Tapos nakat natutulog ka talaga sa barko ngayon, de ba? Yeah. Kailan yung time na pwede ka ng lumabas na magwork as a PT lang sa kanila? Eight to five. Yeah, after work. Because um, it's just like a job. So you go, you go to the ship, or I, I wake up to the ship, and then put a uniform, you assemble like around 7, 7, 15. And there's some certain jobs within around, like this thing, that is, or you need a room, you need to have filters, or you need to have a lot of filters. Because the work that we have now, because we don't have any wala kami mga planes so we don't mm-hmm. get to do our job pero if we do pero we have to move planes ay hindi naman to okay kasi pag tapos na yung trabaho ay na uwi na dati nga ano eh med- yung linya pa sila medyo around like 12 noon tapos na you're free to do whatever you want you can go out um, off ka na talaga kasi parang yung you're off work so wala na trabaho uh, ay trabaho Um, and that unless you're patawag sila, oh, yung balik kayo dito. Which is mm-hmm. like, very, very uncommon. Nangyari lang yung pag may gera. Pero, oh, yun. Mm-hmm. Siguro yung curious ako is, kailan yung parang hindi mo na kailangan dyan mag-stay? Yung parang pwede mo na magamit yung housing allowance mo. Pwede mo na, ano. Kailan, kailan yung time na yun? Depende ba yun sa sa assignment mo? O depende? O dapat may dependence ka na? Dapat may dependence ka na? O dapat? physical therapist ka na, bago ka, okay, hindi na ako dyan matutulog, ha? dito na ako matutulog sa akin, bagong house, sa bagong apartment. Yes. Na- ano yun? Instant na yun. Instant na yun. Once you find a place to stay, once you have dependence, just stay. Uh, so, so right now, you're just choosing to to stay sa ship, pero pwede kang, yeah, kasi, pwede, if you, if you can, oh, if you can, um, what do you call this? Pagkaya mo. Okay. Pag-afford mo siya. Yeah, oh, but if you have independence, you can definitely afford it. So, okay. I don't need to stay in the ship. Right? Oh, so I just mag- stay in the ship. If you have independence, there are acronyms like BA, BA. Yes, when you have a husband, you can do that. No, it's an instant. It's an instant. It's an instant. So once you get married, you're yeah, dependent on your wife. Okay. Ah, okay, naliwanagan ako kasi inisip ko kanina. So, may mga ganito pa. Kailangan ko yung nakukuha. Kasi dyan ka pa, alam ko dyan ka pa rin natutunog sa barko, di ba? 
Yeah. Ano din, choose, choice, choice ko din naman siya kasi in some ways, I get to experience like what it is. May nalaglag ba? Sa bagay, kasi parang nakukuha mo yung full Navy experience eh. Pero nasa barko ka talaga. Tsaka, ewan ko, parang gusto ko yung feeling na nakakambal daw na. Parang may minimalist ka, no? Kasi to be honest, di ba? You get to some point in life na experience things sometimes in napapalaki yung pulo mo. Very true. Gusto ko yung public display. Live simply nga. Diba isang mga din yun. Makakatulong sa atin. Yeah. Live simply. Mga lugo naman. Hindi naman nagawa natin yun. Kasi by the end of the day. By the end of the day is a story. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Kasi pag alam mo na yung binavalue mo, na alam mo uh, sa simple life, is, is satisfied ka na, it, w- it won't take a lot for you to, to sustain retirement. Kasi on top of the benefits, baka nga excessive pa yung mga benefits na makuha mo oh, in the future. Kung, kung sanay ka naman sa buhay na, na ganito lang, lang. kung ano lang yung sinet mo. Para kami sa atin, as a PT, I relate natin na dyan pag nag-treat tayo at that point yan, treat natin is uh, strengthening ng legs mm-hmm. or weakness ng legs. So, nag-prescribe tayo sa sciences yung ginagawa sa clinics. Pero once you educate that that patient how to strengthen their own legs, yung, yung ano yan, yung long-term retention. Mm-hmm. Ako, tinututunan ko na talaga yung legs. Simply ngayon, mm-hmm. para kung matapos na ako, I can use that skill yung Onwards the life thing. Kaya may saying as Confucius, diba? Teach man how to fish. Ah, uh, give man a fish and you'll feed him for a day. But teach man to fish and you'll feed him for a life thing. There's a valuable life skill na ma- ma- makukuha mo aside from the excellent benefits. Amen. <laughs> <laughs> hey, so how do you picture uh, a financially independent mark in the future world? Parang nabanggit mo, parang gusto mo yata tumira sa farm. And may ba- Pero gusto mo na adventure. Uh-huh. No? Pero... So how, how would that look like in the future? That's a good question actually. I haven't thought about that. It actually depends. Siguro yung ano, I wake up na wala na akong naisip na oh, there's gonna be girls at the end of this month. I have to do the work. Um, I'm financially independent that I work out. Oh yeah, I'm gonna be present soon. So I want to be present. Um, I'm gonna work on my cars. Malaki ni siya kung gusto mo kung bakit. It's a farm. Tapos the animals, then the horses. Uh, be with my family. I'm. I, I want to have. Mamay lang kids na Mark. <laughs> Ano ba? Tapos sila, tapos usap na nila 'yun. Oo. Nakikiyano pa rin. Gusto pa lang. So parang nas- nakikita mo 'yung sarili mo na nasa farm ka, pagising mo ganito lang 'yung mga gagawin mo. You oh, just spend your time naalala. Doing the things that you're passionate about mm-hmm. doing, not because yeah. that's the yeah. thing. Kasi eventually, 'yung values naman natin din. Ako I see myself when I get to start a family. I never give value to this to be the best father, the best husband of my life. Yeah, I'm gonna go out and sacrifice. I'm gonna do what's right for myself. I'm gonna do what's right for myself. I'm gonna do what's right for myself. That's good. Ah, uh, approved. Approved. Kami sa ganon. <laughs> Kasi pag hindi ka man ang plano. Mas magiging oh, mahirap. At saka parang sa PT lang ganyan. Short-term goal, long-term goal. Bakit mo ba ginagawa yung mga ginagawa mo sa life mo ngayon? Para saan ba? Para lang ba mabuhay ka para sa tomorrow? Or, alam mo, yeah. may, may plano ka for the future. May long-term ano ka, goal. Just like you, guys. <laughs> so, uh, last, uh, final few questions. 
uh, the, the one is, uh, what's one thing, concept, idea, or belief that you have learned recently that you are comfortable sharing? And how do you plan to apply what you've learned in your life moving forward? Kung may nabasa kang books or napakinggan kang something na pwede mo i-share. Life isn't all about money. Yeah. And then yung meaning ng money talaga. So, money is just not to plant it. Oh, money. Mm-hmm. money is a way to make a game. Okay. You know. Yeah, money is a means. It's a means. Kasi pag naiba mo na yung mindset mo sa money, mag-iiba yung, ano, yung direction sa buwan. Um, ito, example, diba? May tao na, oh, I'm gonna earn a lot of money. I'm gonna buy all these fancy cars, hmm? fancy bags, fancy goods. Kasi lang, hindi rin din nila. Pero once you change your, your mindset about money, Oh yeah, I'm gonna earn a lot of money so that later on I'll be free to like the company. Yeah. Not to want to just just you know, community. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, iba talaga kasi kung ang goal mo is money or ang goal mo is as you said, live with yeah. 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 motivations. That's why it's really important to you know your why saka you know your values din. Kung align ba yung mga ginagawa mo sa life mo with your values. Napaka-importante. Para mas madali yung journey, no? Lalo na sa journey mo, no? <laughs> Medyo parang na-deprive ka of everything. Pero sabi mo nga, it's a good way for you to know what's essential in your life. Very good way. Thank you. Galing mo talaga. <laughs> Ayun okay. kaya. Ayun Uh, next question. Uh, we are always inviting people to live life with intention. No? Uh, do you have any recent purchase of money or time, no matter how crazy or expensive you spend, that what you value or join in the present? Uh, I spend money or mm-hmm. Or time. Or time. Like, mm-hmm. like it's good. Um, you know, I like point one time. Sometimes the tools that I need are you know, a bit pricey. Pero tinitignan ko siya na, oh yeah, I'm gonna buy this too. Pero yung value na ito, para 10 years from now, if I learn how to do this thing, mm-hmm. I'm gonna save, for example, maka, maka, for example, I, I changed the clutch in my car. That's like a $2,000 job. Mm-hmm. I bought the parts and uh, the tool for it. For example, 500 bucks. So, I'm not going to say anything. So, it's mm. worth it time to learn that it's mahal yun for a tool. Because yung iba, isipin nila, isang beses ko lang naman gagamitin, ipagawa ko na lang. Ba't pa ako bibili nito? Ang hirap yeah. ko na ako. Pero sa'yo, yeah. the, the skill also matters. It's the skill. Yeah. Because yung skills, di mo wala sa'yo. Right. So, um, And also, you're, yeah. you're enjoying the, the process of doing that, di ba? <laughs> Yeah, so yung mga investments ko usually, or, well, I call it investments on myself. <laughs> is, it's the skill I get from, or the experience I get from. Uh, for example, I write writing in, in my journals. Nakita niyo naman, di ba? I have some, you know, a bit fancier things, pero it makes me motivated to pick it up, pick up, pick it 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 up, and use it. Tapos yung value naman is I get to write, I get to self-reflect every day, I get to write my goals every day. I write my poems every day. <laughs> yeah. So, I think that is the experience I get from the spending I do. Mm. Or the skills I get. In your, in your yeah. Kasi okay, ano nga, sa, sa atin, pag kasi nagpa-fi ka, talagang tinitipin natin yung sarili natin yung call. Pero katulad yeah. na sa sinabi mo, gusto mo naman yung ginagawa mo na nagpukumpuni ka, nagsusulat ka, ganyan. It brings you joy. Bakit naman hindi mo gagastosan, di ba? Yeah, it's more of like, ano, the, the intrinsic value you get. Mm-hmm. It's not the external value you get. Right. Yeah. May mga, may mga, uh, yung mga purchases mo is, may mga side effect ba na? No. Good side effects. Mm. Tapos, yung kaka-acquire yes. ka ng new skill. Pag nasira yung kotse namin, sure. 
<laughs> kasi madikipit ko naman din eh. <laughs> kasi madikipit ko din naman eh. Kasi oh. nabili ako sa pangayos ng friend. Ay, yung friend nila pinapalitan niya lagi lang. Oh. So, oh. Ko yun, na. Parang napa-front load lang yung, ano, yung last one. Yung expense. Yung last one. Saka parang ang saya na, uy, gawa ko yan. <laughs> ako yung nag-compone yan, di ba? Parang may little wins ka ba? Oh. That's true, that's true. <laughs> Ma- marami talaga kaming natutunan regarding the oh, <laughs> benefits na. Nahihikayat na nga kami mag-ano eh. Parang ano, mag-military na ba tayo? Actually, oh. di ba nung nakausap nga na, na nakausap ka namin nun, parang pinakausap ko na siya, ano ba, pwede kaya tayo mag-military pa? Pero tulad nga na sabi mo, hindi siya para sa lahat. Okay. Kasi parang isipin mo rin, iiwanan mo, iiwanan mo ba talaga yung life mo ngayon? Oo, there's this, ano, benefits. Pero are you really willing to live your life para dun sa mga yun. Mm-hmm. So it, it takes it takes mm-hmm. a, a lot of, of asking your why to why why, mm-hmm. why you want to join the military. Siguro hindi lang siya mainly for the benefits. Oh, oh. dapat. But I think with you naman, I think you're very happy with what you're doing. I, minsan siguro may mga struggles pero lahat naman, di ba? <laughs> yes. Lately, I'm, I'm happier. Siyempre, happier. Medyo alam namin. Medyo alam namin yung happier. <laughs> related ba ito sa military? I don't think so related. Bumalik na tayo dito. So, so if people uh, want to get in touch with you, can they get in touch with you? If yes, uh, where or how? Of course. Uh, you can follow me on my Instagram. It's going to be MCIU08. Okay. Ililink na lang siguro namin sa sa baba. Kasi baka may mga uh, fellow Filipinos tayo na nag-immigrate din dito na wow, na, na single na mukhang oh, gusto okay. ko i-try. That's a good path. Mm-hmm. Oo. Kung gusto rin nila mag-ipon or just to challenge themselves diba? Mm-hmm. Makaya nila. Kung gusto rin nila pag uh, baga, na-emotivate mo sila. Oo. Oh, oh. Parang maging coach ka sa kanila. <laughs> <laughs> Maganda rin naman kasi kang may nagma-mentor sa'yo. Okay. Uh, I like this. I guess I like helping people. Oh, no. Definitely reach out. Mm-hmm. So, ang, to, ang pinaka natutunan ko talaga sa conversation natin is the, the tons of benefits na <laughs> na makukuha mo sa military na almost hindi mo na magagalaw yung paycheck mo. And the other thing na, na sinabi mo is uh, in the military, hindi lang yung benefits na makukuha mo which is you will earn uh, life skills. Mm-mm. kagaya ng pagiging frugal uh, uh, living um, w- well below your means mm-hmm. and living a simple life mm-hmm. ako din uh, aside sa benefits well it's found ko lang ng konti ang, ma- ang pinaka na surprise talaga ako na sa military is yung aalagaan din ba yung family mo saka yung health nyo so parang kasi minsan pagka nagkatrabaho ka and all you have to set aside some money for this set aside some money for this pero sa military may benefits na for that so hindi na siya tatanggalin talaga sa sweldo mo ayun na eh so ang galing kasi most of the time lalo na sa housing yung mga big ba na babayaran the big three the big three <laughs> na mga babayaran parang matanggal mo na siya lahat parang tapos ang ganda pa kasi tinuturuan kayo kung paano ba i-handle yung pera So, parang, ano pa bang excuse mo? Di ba? <laughs> I know there are different circumstances na magkakaroon tayong different struggles. Pero, ang galing kasi, just having that knowledge na pagkatapos mo, ganito dapat yung gawin mo, ito yung benefits mo, ito yung mga dapat mong gawin, ito yung mga pwede mong makuha, parang, kaya mo na eh. Kayang-kaya mo na. Nakuha mo na lahat ng truth. Just have to put it in the Yes, that's the one good way of saying this. Okay. Karon ka pa bang mga ibang maidadagdag sa may share sa amin? Na pwedeng sabihin sa mga makikinig. Well, um, there's always a lot of ways to be financially You have to be creative. So my way to be creative is to join the military. But, uh, like me and Daryl is doing, they're um, They're renting out their house, um, their house hack. So, so a lot of creative ways to get there. Um, so yeah, good luck. Thank you for sharing. Thank you so much so for us. chatting with us. Enjoy namin. We'll, we'll see you when we go here. We'll see you when we go here. Siyempre, siyempre. I will. Thank you. See you guys in the next episode. Bye.